So today I have a story for you, and um, about this kid. For the sake of the video, I'm calling David. It's not his real name. Is uh, real name I will not address, but um, I'm gonna call him David. So one day we're sitting in class, uh, having social studies, which mind you is right before lunch. So um, we all we were all given these paper clips. And him being the smartest kid in the classroom at the moment um, decides, hey, I'm going to fold this paper clip. And I don't know what to do with it. So there he is unfolding his paper clip. No one notices him except this one kid in our class named Damien. Damien plays 64 if you want to check him out. Uh, Damien plays his one word, 64ism. And um, so. We're all sitting in class, and Damien notices this kid, and there's not much special about it. But then when he um, sticks the paper clip in the power outlet, David, well not Damien, is watching David do this. And Damien's thinking, holy crap, this kid is going to kill us all. But he didn't say anything. He wanted to see what would happen. So he sticks it in the power outlet, and to all our surprise... It didn't pop, and no one noticed when it didn't pop. But then he twists, turns it like the key to the gateway of heaven. Probably saw his entire life flash before his eyes. Weird movie reference, probably. And, uh, well, when he did do this, he twisted it, and then he pulled. Uh, and then it pops, and with the amount of adrenaline going through this kid's veins, he probably didn't even notice that. He burnt his hand to a crisp. And um, the teacher saw the last bits of this and all the sparks. The breaker popped, but the lights didn't go off. So the teacher sees this and goes, holy crap. Um, he, she didn't actually say that, but she just said, David, get down to the office right now. And she's a nice teacher, but when you hear her scream like that, you get up off your chair and you scurry down to the office. So since the stench was overpowering and it was just downright a horrible stench uh we all had to move into the atrium and uh, you know because uh we weren't trusted about uh near it and um yeah we're never getting paper clips again but when i peek into the office to no one's surprise there's david sitting there with a um band-aid around his fingers and a ice pack and he's he's crying he's like oh why did i do that he's in pain he's in immense pain because of his finger it's just burnt and so we have our lunch in the atrium we go outside about 10 minutes after we leave the atrium d um and go outside damien not damien uh, david comes along with a bag of cookies and a gatorade pink gatorade like the new pink gatorade i think it's new and he he walks up to me and goes, hey, look at this. And he pulls off his band-aid and shows me his burnt-up finger. And, he, like, it was horrible. It was like someone stabbed him with a pencil. It looked like he, that someone drew lead on his finger. You can see, like, the melted paperclip in the wound. So, <laughs> it had that coloring. And I was like, holy crap, he really burnt himself pretty good. So, he goes around showing everyone his Gatorade and cookies and hmm, screwed-up thumb and... Yeah, I'm pretty sure he would have done it again if he had another paper clip because he said that Gatorade was one of the best he's had in his life. <laughs> so, this is already getting to be a pretty long video. One of the longest I'll ever upload. So, um, yeah, I hope you enjoy. Consider subscribing or don't. I couldn't care less. Uh, leave your like. Like and subscribe in five seconds. Or I'll eat, eat all your ramen noodles. Ah!